Hello, Andy here with Pop Yachts. Today we're checking out a beautiful two owner 2005 Rinker 342 Fiesta V. Beautiful navy blue, hull sides, powerful and efficient twin 350 mag MPI Merc Cruisers paired with Bravo 3 stern drives, counter rotating props, give better power and torque for quick planing speeds and fuel efficiency. Lots of updates done. Sleep six comfortably, lots of deck space. Onboard generator by Kohler with low hours on it. Regular service on the generator and the motors. The air conditioner has reverse cycle heat and the interior can sleep six comfortably. No damage inside or out. Keel looks all good as well. It's normally stored high and dry. Most efficient cruising speed is right around 25 to 28 miles an hour depending on conditions. Top end is 35 and it holds 235 gallons of fuel. Let's go ahead and hop on deck. Easy access to the swim ladder, four steps, folds out, telescoping. Nice extended swim platform back here at the rear. Plenty of grab handles where you need them. A huge storage box right in the transom. That's also accessible from under that transom bench. And I'm a big fan of where they've utilized this space with some seat and cushion. And uh, you've got engine flush out over along the port side. Fuel fill. Four rod holders along the gunnels. When you're cruising, want to do some fishing too. Safety in mind with a nice high transom door. One small nick out of the fiberglass. Definitely not a deal breaker though. Battery switch access. And what's a nice feature when you're done swimming, rinse off with hot and cold fresh water. Nice wide transom bench. Molded in steps along both gunnels if you're pulled up to your favorite dock. Ice maker. Oh, there we go. Gotta go up. Refrigerator with a small freezer. If you want to have your blender hooked up, a couple of plugs, lots of storage. Love how they utilize the counter space with these filler portions where you can pull them out. Nice clean sink and then additional storage under here. Beautiful upholstery. U-shaped lounger with storage under it. Map holder, plenty of Sony six inch speakers. There's also a 12 inch subwoofer down by the captain's seat, extra wide bench seat. This slides forward and backwards. Then you've got a fold up thigh rise bolster, Raymarine C70 radar, and then a nice Garmin GPS map 740S. It's a plotter and fish finder as well. Nice clear gauges, Danforth compass keeps you pointed in the right direction. Go ahead and turn the key on. Port motors reading 245 and starboards reading 240. Standard horizon VHF. All your accessory switches right where you need them. Cockpit lights are LED along the side. Got those turned on. Then some really cool spreader lights up on the radar arch. They go white, they've got dim, they'll go multicolor. Red, blue, purple, orange, yellow, green, all of the above. They'll cycle through or you can lock it in on your favorite color that you like. Remote operated windlass up front. The wheel is a tilt helm. And then the remote spotlight as well. Smooth throttles and shifters. Your trim tab controls have uh, indicator lights on them as well. And then really easy access 
up to the bow area. Beautiful walk through windshield. Full wrap around stainless steel railing. High quality Bomar hatches are all tinted, letting in natural lighting for the main cabin, but then also keeping that heat out with the tint on there. All the fiberglass is in great shape. I see no spider cracking anywhere. All the stanchions are securely mounted, as are the stainless steel cleats. This thing is made for fun. Snaps are in place for a bow cushion if you'd like to have that. They don't currently own one. Love the wide beam. Lots and lots of room. Snap-in carpet also has non-skid pattern underneath it. Makes it removable and easy to clean. Beautiful cabin layout. This sleeps six comfortably. Nice clean carpet. Beautiful wood color. All this upholstery is original. It's been maintained and well cared for its entire life. These are the second owners and they've had a blast with it so far. All the headliners good. All lights are operational. Your upper hatches have complete blackouts or screens if you like to have a cross breeze when not running the air conditioning. Breaker panel operates all the systems on board. Emerson microwave, Mr. Coffee coffee maker, great amount of counter space and storage above and below. Two burner Kenyan stove top, and then a huge fridge inside. They have all the original manuals, in case you have any questions about the systems on board. Forward hanging locker, TV cubby, 22 inch flat panels in there at the moment, and then a Sony CD player. Sirius XM ready and also Bluetooth. You've got an auxiliary input and then there's a six disc changer over on this side next to the air conditioner control. Plenty of storage behind the dinette. Table drops down, turns this into another bed. You can see storage underneath as well. Plenty of power outlets too on either end of that. Very, very clean. I love the forward B-berth. Does full width of the beam, then easy step up for that. And then there's also storage underneath behind those drawers. Mid cabin, very spacious. Got a rear hanging locker back here. Onboard central vac, nice feature for keeping everything nice and clean. Some additional storage underneath. Privacy curtain comes across from both sides. Again, nice clean upholstery. Storage up top in the back. Little hideaway storage area. Keep additional gear or dry goods out of the way. And then behind this mirror, neat feature. Built-in safe. Keep any personal effects safe. Beautiful mount for those steps, securely mounted into the floor, and then a nice solid stainless steel handrail. The onboard head, I'm comfortable being 6'3. Separate shower stall, good amount of counter space, hot and cold water in here as well. There is an onboard macerator in addition to the holding tank, depending on where you're cruising. Do one more slow pan inside. And 
we'll go ahead and open up the engine compartment. Take a look at these beautiful Mercruiser Cruiser 350 Mag MPIs. Go ahead and hit the engine hatch switch. Electric lift on it. And where you going? All right. Brand new lift motor on this. Nice and clean. Fuel efficient and powerful. Mercruiser 350 Mag MPIs are rated at 300 horsepower each. Plenty of access along both sides. Really nice condition. Remember this spent most of its life in fresh water. Four battery bank and water heater over along the starboard side. Easy access to your through holes and then the Kohler generator with sound shield box on it. Hour meters showing 81 and the onboard battery charger as well. Cruises most efficiently between 25 and 28 miles an hour. Top ends 35. Please take this opportunity to check out all of the high resolution photos we have posted on popyachts.com. Look forward to your call today. Again, my name is Andy. Happy to answer any specific questions you have about this beautiful 2005 Rinker 342 Fiesta V. I know you'll be impressed seeing it in person. Every option available, lots of room inside and out. This thing is made for fun on the water. Look forward to speaking with you and meeting you in person. Let's get you out there and having fun. Talk to you soon.